Hi, my name's Steve. I'm from a centre of lifelong learning. Um, we deal in adult education, and that's everybody from about 21 or so right up, and our oldest students are in their 70s or so. Um, we put on a lot of flexible courses for adults, particularly in the evenings. Um, we understand that adults have got lots of other commitments as well, um, school, work, and you've got to fit this in around that, so we're really flexible and understanding about adult needs. The course I want to talk about now is called Gateway to HE. This is a, um, a one-year course, it's free, and it doesn't cost anything, and if you pass it, you're guaranteed a place onto our part-time degree programme. The course runs twice a year. It runs in October for a whole year, um, one evening, six until um, nine. Currently it's on a Tuesday. And then we have another course that starts in Easter and that runs through until July or so. And again, that's once a week in the daytime. The main aim of the course then is actually to make students Warwick ready. What I mean by that is they're ready to take part in the um, undergraduate part-time degree. So the course has got lots and lots of study skills elements in it. Here. Um, there's things like library skills, there's reading skills, skills around debating, um, skills around presenting, essay writing of course, there's a lot of essay writing in it, a lot of feedback, things like this as well. So as well as the topics which we're dealing with, there's a lot of study skills which are embedded in there as well to get people people up to speed and get them confident ready for um, undergraduate study. Okay, the actual schedule of Gateway then, we start very local, we start with ourselves and in the first week we're just talking about ourselves, our journey, how did we get here, where are we going to, where do we see ourselves in 10 years time and really that's just a way of getting to know each other and then slowly we're sort of radiating outwards so in the next week we're talking about the families that we live with or the families we grew up with. Um, the different types of families there are in the world. Then we're going a bit bigger than that, so we're talking about food, the food we eat, uh, where we buy our food, where we go out to eat, where our food comes from, all sorts of questions around food. And we're going bigger still then, and then we're looking at the houses we live in, or the flats we live in. What type of things do we live in? How do we imagine ourselves living in the future? How do people live in the past? These sorts of questions. Then we're going bigger again, and we're looking at the street we live in. And then we're looking at the community we live in, and we're asking questions about all these things. Slowly we're going bigger and bigger and bigger. Um, in the second term, we're talking about much bigger questions around the economy, around working, around leisure time, like this. And then finally, in our third term, um, we're looking at the big questions of globalisation, migration, the environment and things like this. The shorter course has almost the same topics but one or two of them are cut out to fit it all in because it's running over a shorter period of time. Um, we also have some Saturday courses on the shorter um, version as well and they are dedicated to study skills. We'll do one day in the library, we'll, we'll do one day on essay writing, we'll do one day on presenting skills. If you are interested and you want to apply, the best way to do it is via the website. If you go there, you can register interest and someone will be back in touch with you and we'll um, bring you in and you can have a nice discussion with us about it. There's no real entry requirements for the course. There'll be a little interview where we have a chat, but in our experience, if you're an adult and you're thinking of um, going back to university, that's normally enough. You've got life experience. We're not requiring you to have GCSEs, A-levels, a foundation degree or anything like that. You really just need to have your own experience, and that's absolutely fine. Take me for example, I left school at 15, um, it should have been 16 of course, but my birthday was in July, my last exam was in June, so I went out at 15. My best GCSE is grade D, most of them are around E, F or so, I didn't do A levels, um, I went straight into engineering. Um, I was an apprentice, I worked in a factory for 10 years, more than 10 years in fact, and then in my late 20s I decided to come to Warwick to do a degree. Um, I did it full time, um, but I understand the um, pressures, I understand the worries that adults often face when they're coming to university later on in life. And I think part of the um, good thing about Gateway is that we try to um, tackle those um, worries and um, settle people down ready for the um, part-time degree.